I'm doing a quick update on my sugar gliders now. Uh, it's the first time I've had a chance because my cats have just had kittens and I've been concentrating on them because I've had to weigh them and do all that and do the other and I've left my gliders all but cleaning the cage, cleaning all the bedding and putting the food in and to be quite honest with you it's done both me and the gliders a favour. Now if you look back on my other videos I wanted everything now and I wanted it all done now. I wanted my gliders friendly, bonded with me, bonded with each other and I wanted it done straight away. Um, and that won't going to happen. So actually this has all done me a favour and it's done me gliders a favour. Now if, if you've seen my old videos you'll see Joey, he just looked at you with these great big, big eyes, looked at me as if yeah, you come near me and I'm getting in on there. I need to bite you. And he did. And that's exactly what he did. And I'm going to show you the difference from now after leaving them. Um, and this is just putting food in. And yeah, I did put treats in as well. And I've got all my treats and my worms. But generally, I do give them the mush first and then the, the treats and the worms after. Or they don't eat the mush. So, but... For the purposes of this video, I might give them the odd treat. But um, only sugar glider owners will understand this. Once I take you upstairs, the quality is going to be absolutely terrible because you switch the light on, your sugar gliders will go and hide. So, but I'm guessing they're very hungry. Um, and I can switch the bedroom light on and they'll stay there because they're waiting for their tea. So, here we go. Okay, so I've just kicked my cat out for video purposes. And here, I had to put the girl back in. She, she wouldn't. So, let's get going. And there's my other cage there. So here you go. Let's keep my cat out for purposes. So here we go. You're wanting your food. Yay! Go back in. Go back in. Go back in. It's coming. There you go. See? No, go back in. Go back in. Do not want them to come in out. This is these three. Coming right in. And that's including Joey. There you go. Don't see about no, he's only nibbling me. He's only nibbling me, but don't usually leave me hand in. He's after a treat. So there you go. They all come darting to the door. In a second, I'll give you a treat, Luke. Wait. So impatient. Now let me open it first. No, go back in. Go back in. Oops, go back in. Go, go. Get back in, Luke. Luke, honestly. Come on. Get back in. I have one escapee. Which I've got to get back in. I got him in real easy, but I couldn't show you. I just, just, what I, what I did was just guided him with both hands. Opened that a bit and then guided him in like that. 
but I couldn't show you because I needed two hands guide, guide him in. Absolute nothing off them at all. They, it, I can even... They only nibble me now because if they think there's food. He's there in his mush. And there's my other two and then my other two are in there. They, they kind of get up later but they are younger. Yeah, so this is a quick update on my gliders. Um, and this is with doing nothing but giving them food. Don't want to give them too many worms because I want to meet the mush. It's, this is just show you, give him a few. There you go. And that's Joey. Give him a few worms. Just want to show you the difference now. No, no, I don't want to get you back in again. Stay in. When the camera's going, this is odd. This is try. Try and look through the camera. It's, it's quite actually quite hard. Right, that's enough now. You go eat your mush. Mind you, these are really big eaters, so they will eat the mush as well. It's not going near to have some worms. You matey. Can you want some more? Well don't come out, just go back in. My cat's wanting to come in now. So that is a quick update on my gliders. Very friendly and that's with just putting food in. That was the same with the girls. Um, she, the me other one's a little bit quiet since she's had her tail, but she don't come since she had a tail bitten off by one of the other gliders, and she, she don't come out till later. Um, but as you can see, what I've done. Is I've made sure all that's there so they cannot get near each other now because I've put this blanket here and she is a little bit slow at coming out. There's one, but she's in here. other ones in there she's not ready to come out yet and there are my gorgeous little kittens say hello are you awake the office officers are asleep hey There you go. Shall I bring your mummy in now? Well, there's mummy now. Oh, yeah. One, one of my girls had a tail bit off by these three. Uh, I'd, there's quite a distance between them now, but I must have, within cleaning, put it close together. And she got a tail bit off, but... I put that there now, and there is a distance between them now. Um, 
she does come out eventually. She's all right. She's just got a little bit of a shorter tail, but she's fine. And there's them three. All in the kitchen. No more of them. Oh. Go and have some go and have some mush. So I can just feed them through the cage and this is what I do with feeding them through the cage. Put my cats in. <laughs> 